Hello everyone, uh, my name is Vincent Dubanchet uh, from Thales Alenia Space France and I'm the coordinator of the EROS project, whose acronym stands for European Robotic Orbital Support Services. The goal of this project is to demonstrate technologies for a servicer and a client spacecraft in orbit to perform servicing uh, like refueling and orbital replacement unit. All these building blocks will allow us to rendezvous with the client, capture it and manipulate it to perform this mission perspective. Uh, this project is actually merging the previous operational grants uh, led in the European Commission under the Strategic Research Cluster in Space Robotics, so the OG1 to 6, and we merge everything towards a servicing mission with a unified system. So we had the help of all the partners and also the help of uh, the Canadian champion MDA for the robotic design and of Kinetic, a Belgium company in charge of uh, docking system design. In this project, Thales Alenia Space in France was in charge of the mission and system design as well as the overall GNC architecture and validation. Hello, my name is Juan Antonio Bejar from GMV. I am the project manager of EROS activities in the frame of GMV project. In EROS project, GMV contributes to support integration of the building blocks from the previous operational grants. This is SROCOS OG1, ERGO OG2 and OG6 facilitators. GMV in the frame of EROS contributes to the design and implementation of the satellite guidance function in charge of rendezvous, capture, docking and servicing operations and also support Thales Alenia's space in France in order to validate the GNC. GMV also provides support to integrate ESA ACIS refueling interface device in the frame of EROS demonstration and also platform art is proposed as the test facility for EROS demonstration. So in the scope of this EROS project, the main outcome is to boost the maturity of European industries in the space sector towards servicing mission in orbit. With that respect, we have three main points and three main achievements. The first one is the maturity of the key building blocks used for uh, the robotic aspects of such mission with the autonomy layers and um, autonomous approach and navigation. The second one is the integration of these building blocks together to show that they are actually compliant one with the other and that they can apply for a mission, either scientific or commercial one, uh, in the near future for rendezvous mission and contact without contact. And the last one is actually the maturation of the validation means that we use for such building blocks and for such mission, exactly as the test bench you have just here for the robotic experiments. Platform R facility allows increasing the technology readiness level of EROS software and hardware elements in a space representative scenario for on-orbit servicing operations based on visual navigation, promoting the autonomous activation of the different phases to accomplish the mission. The successful test performed today in the EROS project is key for the future space ecosystem roadmap and is the first step to the on-orbit servicing demonstrator. The last year has proven how the commercial potential of servicing could change the landscape of commercial space forever. Europe is now in a position to perform a pioneering orbital demonstration mission in servicing, showcasing the European capabilities and fostering new business opportunities for the future space ecosystem.